Annalise. <laughs> Hello, the first to arrive. Very warm welcome. How are you doing? Thank you for joining. Hi, Linda. Sabrina. Very warm welcome. Thank you for coming along for this evening's meditation. Lovely to see you all. Hi, Annalise. Hello, uh, Fedashik. <laughs> welcome. Very warm welcome. Welcome to the Drunken Monk Meditation Thursday, six o'clock every week on Instagram. Thank you for joining me. Lovely to see you too, Linda. Hope all is well in your world. Ah, hello, it's uh, Sylvia. <laughs> nice to see you, Sylvia. How are you doing? How's things in Portugal? Hello, Sabrina. Madalena. Oh, lovely to see you. So much love to you, my dear. Thank you for joining. Wow, look, a, a lovely little virtual space happening. So, hello, <laughs> everybody. Let's get settled. Let's get settled. And I hope you're ready for some connecting. I thought today's theme, connection, connection, connecting to ourselves. So before I go into that, the practicalities, talking about connection, connection with the universe, collaboration with the universe, I'm so happy to be announcing that a week on Monday on May 17th, we'll be doing a two week manifestation course. And the early bird tickets finish tonight, 11.30. So if you want to join me for that, then uh, this is a good time to get great value for this course. And I'm going to be sharing everything I've learned over the years, all the insights and what manifestation is. Because to be honest, when I was young, dumb, and maybe still a bit dumb, I thought manifestation was like a shortcut that I could wave a magic wand and my life would just turn into beauty and become amazing. Um, but what I realized is the first thing about manifestation is being clear about what you want, you know, and then overcoming the self-limiting beliefs and being realistic, being realistic about what it is that you want to achieve and what you want to feel and what you want to experience and how you want to share and connect with people. So it's all about collaborating with the universe and being clear. So if you're ready to spend a two week intensive and really going into these issues, then join me a week on Monday and I look forward to seeing you there. But let's start this evening with connecting, connecting to the present moment, straight off the bat, connecting with the here and now. And the best way to do that is to bring your attention into the body, into the breath, into your senses. Taking a conscious breath and letting go. Letting go of the day, of thoughts, connecting to whatsoever is alive in you right now, so we're not pushing anything away, but releasing the compulsion to think about the past or project into the future. You know what that feels like. Letting that go, holding the intention, you know, making a a connection with yourself and even saying to yourself, okay, I commit right now for the next 15 minutes, I'm going to connect to the present moment. I'm going to clear my mind and simply be here now and do nothing. Do nothing. Just be. So the easiest way, start with the body connecting with the breath, letting go of any little tensions that you might find in your legs, lower back, hips, shoulders. Just ah, take a breath, let it go. Also the muscles in your face, around your eyes, the jaw. Even there's 80 muscles in the face, isn't that amazing? And simply letting everything go soft. And allowing your breath to do the work. Letting your breath be natural and flowing. And you'll notice that by holding your attention in your breathing, it becomes more kind of rhythmic and calm. It starts to have a, a gentle flow, a pulse. 
So just tune into that. Even if it's a little bit more rapid, just flow with it. You know, giving yourself the few moments to simply slow things down. So the thoughts slow down, the breath slows down, but not forcing anything. Just holding the intention to connect with yourself. This feeling of being connected. And you'll notice when that starts to really crystallize, the body just automatically starts to soften. And there's this feeling of sinking, this subtle feeling of energetic expansion. There's maybe a subtle joy that rises, a feeling of release, relief even. Being here now, so just stay with that for a couple of moments, following the flow of your breath and holding the intention to be present. So it's like making a conscious wish. You know, it's not a command, you're not forcing it, it's simply making a wish. And it's really easy once you let that sink in, like, like rain falling in the ground remember from last week, just merging with the intention, being here. And then as you start feeling this connection deepening with, with your body, your physical body, you become more aware of your senses and the feelings, the sensations that flow within and around your body. There might be some emotions there. Some issue or a feeling, a tingling, an energy. So simply being open to that, this feeling of aliveness. It's not necessary to try and fiddle with things or to try and resolve things in the past. You know, the mind's great at pulling us back into stories trying to get your attention here and there. Really anchor yourself into the present by holding your attention in the body with the breath, with the here and now. And the feeling of moving into meditation and connecting with the aliveness of this moment, there's a feeling of ease there's an easiness, a relaxation. So there's no longer the tendency to resist or try and change something or to complain or to judge or to analyze or to label. All these activities of the mind, we don't need that right now. We don't need to think about anything in this moment. Simply connecting, connecting to yourself, holding that intention, and relax. And then the next connection point is you, is your awareness, the part that is observing. And when you connect to that part, you open up to this collaboration with the universe. There's a harmony. You become more open to insights and intuitions, to being guided, to knowing right action, or simply to feel at peace, to be at peace. Connecting to the body, the heart. But simply being aware And this is the key to meditation, the capacity to relax in the part of you that is aware and to hold that, holding that connection. And what that means is you're not prone to being pulled into a story 
or distracted by a thought. So you can still be moving, walking, listening. There's this feeling of being connected. And from there, a, a sense of certainty arises. There's a strength, a knowing, kind of quiet confidence. There's nothing to prove to anybody. There's nothing to do right now. Observing the breath, observing the body, being connected to the experience that arrives through your senses, the experience of vision, listening, the experience of smell and taste and touch. And being very still, not only feeling on the physical level, but on the emotional level, on the energetic level. There may be a subtle sense of energy flowing within and around your body, tingling in your hands, a flow along your spine. Being open to that. Being aware of every breath, being present in every breath, is holding you in the moment, sustaining that quality of being here, conscious, I am that I am. without any compulsion to do anything. There's no need to think or to solve anything. And it's so nourishing to give yourself the space to simply be, to connect with a natural aliveness, the flow of energy stillness, the peace, the joy of simply being. And being aware of one moment flowing into the next. fall into this sense of timeless easiness. The reality of here and now is so alive, so vital. and being connected to your body and your heart, feeling that relaxed openness, the acceptance, the surrender, trust, this knowing of being connected to something so wonderful, mysterious, this consciousness, beyond concepts, beyond words, beyond ideas or thoughts, to simply rest there.
every breath as you breathe out this feeling of release, this feeling of, of letting go a little deeper into the silence. little deeper into your being. Or a little deeper into being. And this feeling of being here, connected. Connected to the room. Connected to your city, to your environment, to your, to your earth, to your home. And simply being with that, feeling it, knowing it, being nourished by it. This is freedom. The joy of being. So thank you so much for joining me in this virtual sanctuary. I'm dancing in the ocean of consciousness. <laughs> Who knows what it is? It's amazing though. And it's so lovely to share this space with you today. Thank you so much. Take care. So thank you, Micah. Thank you, Sabrina. I'm glad you enjoyed it. So lovely. One of my favorite moments of the week. Thursday, hanging out for you guys. A little meditation. So, Namaste, Gasso. You're very welcome. Oh, <laughs> there's Amanda. Thank you, Heinz. Yes, yeah, a pleasure for me to Madalena. Take care. Thank you, Jennifer. Have a lovely, have a lovely evening. <laughs> I'm like twenty times one. Oh, thank you, Linda. I'm glad it was refreshing for you. Thank you, Annalise. <laughs> That's all right, Amanda. It's lovely to see you. You're very welcome, Sylvia. Nice to see you here. Okay. Thank you, guys. Take care. I will see you at the next session.